guys, so we are in the King Abdullah Masjid. It's a famous masjid in Amman. And look how big the dome is. Oh, guys, do you know where we are? We are in the famous street. And, it's, and the name is uh, Rainbow Street. It's a famous street in Amman. And look at how beautifully they decorated. Huh? Oh, God, look at this place. We are in the famous street. It is the rainbow street. You know how beautifully they decorated, huh? Look at that. <sighs> Wow! Guys, do you know where are we now? We are in al Balad shops. There are so many shops, I can't even believe my eyes. Look at how many people are shopping in so many shops. Enjoying and enjoying the beautiful shops. Huh? Look at this food shop. Yes, there are so many traditional uh, shops here. Look at, see? And look at these. Even I can see the Jordanian people here. Look at all the cars. Those are the Jordan people. The traditional clocks and things. Oh, look at this. I also can see the Palestinian tradition people around this. Hi guys, it's me again. So today is Monday, and I just woke up and uh, took a morning walk. And now we, uh, we came to a buffet and look at my teddy bear pancake. It's with honey. Guys, so today is Monday, so. Now, we are going to a new city and we are getting ready. Okay guys, so now we are at the viewpoint. Where can we see the Roman theater? I'm a little bit far away from that. But this is a very good point to see the Roman theater. How beautiful. Okay guys, so now we have come to an important ancient place of Romans. And this is the place where they call the Roman Temple of Hercules. Where they worship their gods here. This is one of the famous archaeological sites of Romans here. Years and years passed, but we still can see the remaining of their buildings here. Okay guys, so now we are at the Archaeological Museum of Roman Temple of Hercules in Jordan. They have collected the remaining of their life and kept it in the museum here. See their skulls. It's so scary. So this is the replication of Petra and we will be visiting Petra in the coming days too. They have the customs of the, keeping the dead child in their homes. This is child burial. Guys, see the coffins. They keep the dead bodies inside these coffins. And close. Here, it, this looks like a treasure. They have uh, collect all their footprints and Put them inside the museum. See. Guys, so this is the uh, place of Romans. Romans are washed 
worship their gods in this place once upon a time. After that, Umayyad, they wash. They came to this place and changed it to a masjid. They worship Allah. They are Muslims, and Romans are non-Muslim. And that's why you can see the dome here. How big the dome is. Guys, do you know one interesting thing? In Jordan, they have the mixed culture of Romans and Umayyads. They have the mixed culture of Christian and Muslim. They build this. That's why wherever we go, we can see those two cultures everywhere. Do you know, guys? Romans are very clever. They build a castle in the middle of the city and rule around the cities. And you see that flag. You see the Jordan flag over there. Okay, guys. So now we are at the cave of the seven sleepers. Now you are going to enter. Long, long time ago, once upon a time, so there were seven uh, people who are stuck in a cave. It is one of the Islamic historical place. I will mention the seven sleepers in the Quran. Surah Al Kahf. Kahf means cave. It's a story in the Quran. I will mention that. A story in the Quran. So this cave is situated in Jordan, and uh, we are going to see the cave, the Seven Sleepers Cave. This is the cave, guys. Allah wants to protect those Seven Sleepers, Seven Sleepers from bad people, and made them sleep more for more than three hundred years. <laughs> Let's go inside. <laughs> wow, subhanallah. This is the cave. place where the seven sleepers were stuck. This is the cave. Subhanallah. So the seven sleepers were buried here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, guys, so now we are at the Jarash city. Now we are at a very special place. It's the Roman palace. And had a look at how they wrapped me with the Palestine scarf. And I got this a camel Jordan thing. Shiny. <laughs> so now we are going inside to us show you everything what's inside. Come on. They have a nice market and it's really beautiful inside. You see those dresses? Uh, no caps fit for me, but they wrapped me with this scarf.
Čo vám na rigor bolo trikom, bolo chlesti. Now she's the queen of desert. High five. She is a beautiful bottle art. I get it. These are the traditional dresses and you see all these. Come on inside. You see this teapot, towel, camel, is a baby camel. Baby camel. Is a baby camel over here. Okay guys, so now we are at the archaeological uh, place of Romans in Jarash. It's a very nice place. Take a look. You see how they build all the beautiful large buildings. Mama, where's the lace cap? So see the huge entrance and it's the same as this magnet. So these buildings were very powerful once upon a time. These buildings show how Romans were strong long, long time ago, once upon a time. Hi, Kai, do you see me? I'm in the heart. Whoa. <laughs> Guys, I'm very tired. It's a long way walking in the hills and deserts. It's going to take a long way, guys. It's a, you see the studies here. It's a very long way. Everyone's going to melt. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Okay, go there the hole is small, small the hole, go there. Hello. Name me. Oh, nice. So this is by Greek, huh? Yeah, this is a Greek. Yeah, exactly. Uh, this is language. Yeah, yeah. How many people do you sit here? Five thousand people. One side VIP, two side VIP. Yeah, yeah. Okay guys, so we are on our way to City Ajalon and now we, we found a beautiful grape farm and you see the grapes hanging on the leaves. See? You see all these kinds of it. Yummy as I know. See? Guys, it's yummy. It's very beautiful. So see how big the farm is. And look at these grapes I picked. <laughs> Okay guys, so now we are at the palace of Salahuddin Ayubi. He is one of the uh, he is one of the important leader of Islamic histories. He helped us to win Masjid Al-Aqsa from Romans. Okay guys, so you see those age color places? Those age color places are where Salahuddin Ayyubi's family ruled the world.
This is the period where Salahuddin Ayyubi's family ruled the world. So these are the small stones they used during wartime. Wartime means fighting their enemies. Okay guys, so now we are at the place of <laughs> Prophet Hidul He lives here. This is story. This story is in Surah, Surah Al-Kahf 2, just like the seven sleepers. This is the city Ajilun in Jordan. So come, let's see his place. Where did he worship Allah? Okay guys, so today is Wednesday and we had the Mount Sebo where Prophet Musa the first time saw the uh, land of Palestine in Jordan. He stood here and he saw the land of Palestine. This is the land of Palestine. There. Christians covered this place and they build up their own church and look at their drawings. Yes. Okay, there are architects. They are drawing everything. <coughs> Guys, do you know where are we now? We are at the border of Jordan and Israel. So somehow we have got to see our land at least. Okay guys, so today is Thursday and we are <coughs> at the grave of a Prophet uh, Shuaib alayhi salam. He is the father-in-law of Prophet Musa alayhi salam. Come on, let's go. And you see these cats? So this is the Prophet Shuaib Musa. Okay, guys, so now we have come to the shrine of the prophet Ayu. Come on, let's go inside and check. Okay, let's go and can can wear our salam to Prophet Ayub. Salam alaikum. Salam alaikum. Ahlul Antum al-Sabiqun. Wa nahnu bikum. Lahiqun. Insha'Allah. Nahnu wa yakum yawm fi jannati insha'Allah. Insha'Allah. His name, Balas Ayub alayhi salam. Number one, Ayub alayhi salam sit down under the tree in the corner. The tree here in Midana, mashallah. In 2018, the tree Sheikh kept it. Why? Bid'ah. Assalamu alaikum. Ya ayah al-Nabi Yusha. Assalamu Gorgeously tanned in summer, 
First one, ballast tomb, and this is the next one. This is the iron tomb, like like the treasury, you know. Mm -hmm. The second one, and the the third one there. going to a campsite <laughs> we always need marshmallows <laughs> so we need marshmallows every time with it the stars. Guys, come, let's see the tents. You see those tents everywhere? All those? That is the same tents. Okay, guys, so we are back from Jordan to uh, our home and we had so many, so much fun there and we saw so many fantastic things and we saw Islamic histories, the world histories and many more. We passed seven uh, cities the end of the video so if you want to watch more of my video just click on the subscribe below like share if 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 you want to see more of my video do you know how to spell my name okay l a i n i lini okay see you again